M talk. Uh oh. looking proper now, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Eric from the Beamer Fam. Today, we have a few things on the agenda. I'm gonna hop in the M5, get my hair cut real quick, and then uh, Danny with the F80 M3 is gonna get a stage two tune. fragrance as well yeah it's time to cruise on let's get it as you guys can see my hair man it's been a bit long for the past few videos we're gonna go ahead and get that addressed real quick i need to get my steering wheel clean i ran out of leather conditioner Now you guys can see what the hair looks like before. Way too long. I should. I, I've been waiting way too long to get it cut. So now we're gonna go ahead and check Ben out and have him get it done. Bam! I got chopped up. Man, I kind of look like Will Smith off uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. <laughs> Keep in mind, you know, once I take a shower, all this uh, it's gonna curl up and it's gonna get a lot shorter. But man, clean cut. You know, fresh line up and everything. Uh, now it's time to hop back in the M5. Uh, check out Danny with the M3 and get this tune underway. person with the haircut got the wind hit my head and everything Backfire as soon as you lost the gas. <laughs> it sounds so good. <laughs> oh, my God. Now we fast forward a few hours into the day as you can see I took a shower so you know your boy hair looking proper now you know what I'm saying I know all y'all know the feeling of what it's like to get a fresh haircut it's such a good feeling but now we're we finally got the call from Danny we're gonna go ahead and head over to his crib tune his M3 he's gonna go stage two he's got a F80 M3 competition so it's gonna be interesting to see the gains and the power from this but we're pretty much just gonna hit up my beamer brain he's out in Florida he's gonna remotely tune the M3 from across the country once again. Man, the M5 is super dirty right now. I don't even have armor all on the car. The good thing about this color though is even it is clean even when it's dirty. Let's get on the road. Got the Jimmy Johns with me. Look at watch the turning radius on this car. Watch this. Look at that. 
Look at that. Look at that. E39, they don't make them like this no more, I'm telling y'all. I want you guys to comment your favorite part about the E39 M5 below right now in the comment section. so hard to think about actually selling the car. I'll have to go into my reasoning behind wanting to sell this car in a different video. Aside from all this mess on the seat, just look how clean the interior is. I needed to do a detailing, but like just the styling though. The trim, the two-tone, the manual. Oh, it's so timeless in here. better from here. Check out this driveway. This is some shit you see in California. Look at this. This is in Michigan, by the way. The driveway goes all the way up there and there's a fat house in the corner. It's technically this is in Ann Arbor, but it's its own, I guess, like town. Like technically it's a city but it's actually just a privately owned neighborhood. So the, the state and stuff does not own this place. Pretty much a whole bunch of rich people do. And look at that deer. But I mean, as you can see some of the houses up here, just legendary out here. It's like Hidden Hills, the Hidden Hills of Michigan. So cool to me. That house is nice too. See like all in the hills back there, another house. Now we have arrived. There goes the M3. Can't forget the waterfall. Here goes the X5M. So I'm definitely in the right place. Ooh. So as you can see, I just made it out to Danny's crib. He's got his F80 M3, which sounds amazing. And now he's about to do the stage two tune. So for those of you guys who aren't familiar with this car, 2018 M3 competition. It's got the M Performance exhaust, carbon diffuser, carbon pretty much everywhere, carbon lip. Um, it's got the nice competition wheels, of course. You lock it, he did lock it. Carbon fiber on the mirror cap. He painted the reflector. And then he has a carbon fiber front lip as well. And on the cockpit, we'll open it up in a second. It's got a custom steering wheel and, of course, those beautiful red competition seats. So it's safe to say this thing has a proper pan to spec. Um, but now let's let's get right into the dirty work, pull off the computer, get out the cable, hook it up into the OBD reader, and let's get some more horsepower for Danny. <laughs> got the laptop hooked up now he's about to run the bm3 was it boot mode boot mod 3, boot mod three. yeah uh, stage two down pipes tune so i just got down pipes put in today and some high flow air filters other than that stock ccp nothing else done to it um, i might do the charge pipes might do um metal charge pipes because the bmw uses plastic charge pipes that are supposed to be like really brittle or something I don't know. I talked to a guy who does dining tuning, and mm -hmm. he said the charge pipes were fine, but I don't know who to trust because other people told me they'd explode as soon as you turn up the boost. So, man, what's up with BMW and using these plastic parts, man? They just got—they got to put that extra money down into these better parts.
So he just went ahead and finished it up. Uh, now we got the car running. Just checking to see if everything's idling properly. Um, when I did the stage one flash, I had some misfires at first and then the engine f figures out its own timing. Like, oh, it just okay. figures out itself. I had a little bit of that when it first started, but then it figured itself out really quickly and now it's idling absolutely perfectly. Now we're gonna go for a quick drive to make sure everything works properly. different bro Alec, if you're watching this video, it reminds me of your car, bro. <laughs> Definitely most. 
like 5,000 RPMs. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Goodness. Comes guys. It's so dark and peaceful out here, but this is about to change. <laughs> Yo, it's kind of freaky out here. It's pitch black out here I'm on this road. But man, Danny's car sounds insane. Big ups to Danny. He needs to hurry up and get back. I ain't trying to get took by no monster, you know what I'm saying? But that's nuts. Let me know what you guys think about the exhaust note on his F80 now. Huge transformation. I hear him. Here he comes. Yo, that was insane. Oh my gosh. Listen, I know you hear him. Oh my goodness. Chaos. Damn. That's what it is. Absolute beast. Dude, you're gonna love that. I think what's cool about this tune is uh, if you want, you can just put it into comfort mode and just cruise. And there's no dead silence. There's and no gunshots. Yeah, no, with active sound off, this car is like not quite Tesla quiet, but it, it gets close. Like it's on the expressway, it's almost dead mm -hmm. sound. With, I mean, the, the soundproofing in this car is amazing. And the active sound that they added actually ruins the soundproofing. It, it pumps in this engine noise in the cabin. You don't realize how truly soundproof this car is until you've turned that active engine noise off. It's not an option within like the, uh, the control system. It's the only option that you can tune out or unplug something in the back. Oh, yeah. interesting. Yeah, this is a dope tune so far. Obviously, we're gonna see more of what it's like. Yeah. But first impressions, man, this is dope, Insane. man. I definitely need some new tires now. Like, <laughs> I just, I'm not gonna, I don't know how much horsepower it's making right now. Yeah. But definitely enough that I'm getting wheel spin through second gear without, you know, traction control on. Yeah. So there we have Danny's M3 parked back up in the garage. If you guys like the video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Check out Danny's Instagram as well. Also check out Beamer Fam's Instagram at Beamer Fam. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.